have a learner round off in just a few minutes. Super easy, beginner friendly, and you can totally learn this at home. Let's get started. First warm up cartwheels. Arms up by your ears. Step forward with your good leg. Turn your hands sideways, push off, kick, kick, and land. Although you don't technically have to have a cartwheel to learn a round off, it is gonna make it a whole lot easier. So go try my cartwheel tutorial first. It's gonna be super fast to learn and it'll make this a breeze. Cartwheel step together. So normally in a cartwheel, your feet are staggered when you land, but try to have them landing in the exact same spot right next to each other. Do the exact same thing, but this time try to have both your feet land down on the ground at the same time. Try to lean with your arms up by your ears, chest up. One trick is to force yourself to jump slash imaginary rebound out of it so you can force yourself to get your chest up. If you've been able to do this, you've mastered the basic gist of a round off. Now we're just going to learn how to hurdle or step into it. Okay. Arms by your side, stand with your feet together. You're going to swing your arms up and skip, bring that good leg up. I'll be the leg that you would kick a soccer ball with. Step, skip, step, skip, step, skip. Keep practicing that until it's muscle memory, aka you can do it like blindfolded without thinking twice about it. Now we're gonna connect those two together. So do your hurdle step and reach your arms out in front of you to the side like you're gonna do a cartwheel. And land with both feet together. You want to try to land with your chest up and arms up in the air, not bent over in a squat. If you push hard enough in the round off, your body will naturally bounce or rebound up on your own without you having to force yourself to jump. So keep practicing this a few times and once you've gotten all the way through, you've got your round off. <laughs> 